hey guys welcome back to my channel if you are new welcome as well so today we are doing this face right here yes this is my everyday type of makeup look so this is how i go out you guys so we are trying to clean that so the first thing that we are going to do is to go in with this pons flores radiance micellar water this water helps me to clean you know to also you know uh brightens also you know remove makeup so one thing that i'm going to do is to use this cotton uh wool and i'm just gonna like put the water into the cotton and i'm just going to gentle guys gentle because this winter my face lord has been like giving like you giving me problems guys like it's been breaking so i'm making sure that i'm gentle with removing this makeup because i've got like so painful pimples because i'm standing for you guys can't really see it maybe I'll, i think i'm gonna come closer so that you can see everything so i'm just using that to make sure that i am cleaning and making sure everything is moving this is my to go remover like you know it removes a lot can you see that like oh my god that can make you actually stop wearing makeup <laughs> so this winter you guys you want to make sure that your face is always moisturized and you're always making sure that it is hydrated you want to make sure that it is clean never ever go to bed with your makeup on like guys please so i like to take most of the time to clean everything like i do not like if my morning routine is like two minutes then my night routine is gonna be like so thorough especially if i wore makeup that time so i want to make sure that that is done so another thing that i want i like to do is to go in with this my cellar water and clean my mouth you know my lips i always bite my lips and they become dark and they're always like dirty and stuff so another trick that i do for my eyes is to put the cotton bud to the cotton wool hold and then wipe and voila guys gone it is gone that that is how powerful this micellar water is i've had people saying that the ganya micellar water is really good i haven't tried it i think i should just try it i'm not sure but this uh micellar water is really working for me so yeah i'm like yeah as you can see guys i really took my time to remove makeup this will help me for my next step so the next step that i'm going to do is to go in with this um do the ocean african black soap y'all i love this baby it's new i'm trying it it firms uh, and tones my skin it exfoliates it protects it smoothes it treats my acne very well i just started with this soap and y'all i got it from uh this i'm to i'll just link her socials down below please contact her if you need the soap it's about 70 rands so just check on my description box i'll just put her there and you know just hit her up and ask for the soap if you are interested it is the soap guys if you know that um if you watch uh videos on african uh, soap black soaps you would know that most people recommend so here is a soap for you to apply and it is so it smells like f it's so earthly it's so nice so i really like to go in with it because also it is an it has an agent a cleaning agent as well other than like soothing and treating my acne and dark spots it has this you know shine after effect like i feel like i'm glowing since i've started this this would be my day five of using the soap i'll do a detailed video on it and also to help you guys notice which one is fake which one is original so i'll just do a, t a detailed video on this soap so i like to let it sit a little bit so that it you know sit as a mask a little bit then go wash everything and pet guys i'm not wiping anything i'm not gonna wipe because it's painful can you see like how mad it becomes sometimes it can be drying so you just need to test which one works better for you so we're going in with this bentonite clay i'm not gonna even talk much about this uh, bentonite clay because um i have a full detailed video on it i'll just link uh, the video down below so one advice that i will tell you guys is that you use wooden and plastic utensils please because it's gonna react if you're going to go in with metal so you want to make sure that you are going in with wood or plastic and also make sure you mix this is the time where you choose your consistency you should know that uh, the thicker consistency of this product means that it's gonna like tighten you more and the lighter consistency is gonna like tighten you less i swear you guys i really love this product i always use it 
but I do not have the strength to let it dry like fully dry because it gets itchy so you just need to try and see what works for you and what is it that doesn't work for you as much as the soap that I uh, the black soap that I told you sometimes it can be drying so you just need to figure out how to work with, with it like for me I don't let the water stick I mean stay for longer on my face I immediately go in with this the, the, the moisturizer or the next step that I'm going in with if I'm not applying a mask so I just like to use my hands well on my video i used a brush you know to be fancy but here i just like you know what let's use our hands and that is how the mask is looking and a little goes a long way that is what i was left with so this is how the mask is looking it's not fully dry but it was getting a little bit itchy that is the time where i know that i need to remove okay i don't know what she's doing but yeah so i go and wash my face and pat uh, the, the the face wash on my face and i feel like i left a little on my eye right there so the next step that we are going in with is this witch hazel and rose water it minimizes pores reduces inflammation fights acne it's a healing agent it's so the skin lord it removes my blemishes you guys like this is my right order usually on uh, during winter guys i get dry like my face just acts up like but this is so hydrating it even smells good so i like to go with a cotton bed and what am i saying cotton pad and make sure that i am using it as a toner so yes i've as you notice you guys usually i would moisturize using um the poshia m product but because it's winter it's a bit so tingling and it's so dry so I did go into this other beauty website and check why is my face so drying even after I applied an oil and they encourage that I use water-based oil so you need to make sure that you need uh, water-based oils so I was like oh okay that makes better that makes sense so we're going in with this glycerin yes the old glycerin it moisturizes your skin it treats acne infections wrinkles fine lines and one effect that I really love it makes my skin so smooth Lord so smooth and it just looks glassy and I like to mix it with the witch hazel and rose water because I don't want to like I don't know the intensity it has on my face because sometimes it can be too much so again you need to know how you work with this and again you would know that uh, during the, when we we're growing uh, they would mix it with something else so I didn't want the full um, percentage of the glycerin on my uh, skin so I use it for my lips for my hairs and my eyes you know just to all make sure that I'm moisturized so y'all that is my steps for hydrated and moisturized skin like that that is my holy grail night time i feel fresh i sleep very well so i was like why didn't i know about this like during the past winters because i was cracking so another thing because i told you guys i'm suffering from pimples i go with this um i always go with this pimple uh, leave on uh, gel and i just like put it on my pimples and make sure that it dries and then voila i'm done i go to sleep just like that so you guys one thing that i would advise you during this winter is always make sure that your skin is hydrated it is moisturized you want to make sure that you're using um correct products for this step and that is it from me thank you so much for watching please don't forget to subscribe to like and comment and i will see you guys on the next one bye